Hey guys, it's Andrea. I'm back today with another boxing, and this time it is We Blessings. And I get this box for myself and my son and my daughter. It's $8 shipping fee. You don't get that included or deducted if you buy something. That's just a flat fee. Um, today I'm gonna be opening my daughter's, and I've already opened it. I already did an opening video and I totally messed up the information I was giving out. So I just couldn't put that out there because it was just too incorrect. So I'm going to do it again and this time give you the correct information. I was all confused in my head. Surprise, surprise. Okay. Stella's stylist, the last one, loved it. She did an excellent job. Stella just didn't like some of them because they weren't her style, but it wasn't the style that's bad. The clothes were super cute, and we kept a couple. This time, she's hit it out of the park again. There's only a couple things I'm not crazy about. The first thing I'm not crazy about is this long sleeve striped tee. It is super soft. Um... It's Old Navy. I just don't love it because I hate the color maroon. That's that's just a personal preference of mine. This shirt is $7. That would be your price to buy it. Suggested retail is $13. They only charge you seven. Next, I don't love item are these denim leggings. I just don't for, care for fake denim looks, but they're super cute, super soft, stretchy. They're Carter's, and they have a suggested retail of $16. Um, we Blessings only charges you $8. Stella will probably like them because she doesn't really care for jeans. I like the jeans. I like her to wear jeans. Next is a Isaac Miserati sweatshirt. Very bright striped orange. And on the set it says, a classic cool and sequence. There is a hoodie pocket. It's very lightweight. Great for fall, not too heavy. And for this, they are asking $16 for it. It has a suggested retail of 34 which is way too much in my opinion. 16 sounds about right. That's what I like about these weed blessings is their prices are very reasonable. Next up is an Old Navy t-shirt and this I think is just the cutest little white. It is super soft as well. Old Navy makes the best cutie t-shirts for a good price. This has a suggested retail of $17. They are asking nine. This is a definite. I will definitely buy this, even though she needs no more t-shirts, but I can't help it. It's too adorable. I do like this. If she likes it, I'll get it. Next up are these jeans. I am in love with these jeans. They're blue spice denim, skinny fit stretch jeans. Suggested retail, $38. They are asking $19. Just look how adorable these are, you guys. Stretchy lace-up backing. Scylla normally doesn't like these closures, but on this one, it's super easy to do. I mean, it's not difficult at all. I know she won't have a problem with it, there are no adjustable tabs in it. Um, I love them. This will be up to me if she likes them or not, because she'd say no to all jeans if she could. I love them, even though they are almost $20. If they fit her, <laughs> I'm going for it. This, hands down, she'll love. This is Oshkosh Bagosh. It is an emoji cat shirt. Too cute. Stella will go bonkers for this. She loves cats and she loves emojis. Kiss meow. Not right meow. Love you so meow. And so on and so forth. Adorbs. Oh, let's see how much this is. Um, 
suggested retail 18 they're asking nine this are some carters blackest black drawstring joggers they have a nice big cargo pocket here um the bottoms of stretchy cuff these are like um they're real soft they're like a linen material they're not stretchy they have no stretch um they're made out of 60 percent cotton 40 percent what the heck is that viscose um i think these are fine I think they're pretty cute. They're asked, suggested retail 32. Mm, no, ma'am. Um, they're asking 16. Mm. Stella's either gonna have to look like the cutest little thing that ever walked the earth in these, or she's gonna have to absolutely love them for me to pay that. Next is Seven for Mankind. This is a very pricey brand. Retails $59. They're asking $29. And they are adorable. I'll give you that. And they got these weathered, hemmed and the un then unhemmed look about them. The worn hemmed look. Except in their brand new. Um, I'll have to wait and see what she looks like on this because she really is set with jeans. I gotta say, Stella's stylist is the bomb. If she's watching this, girl, you rocked it. Rocked it last month, rocking it this month. I mean, she. Oh, and I wanna say too, that's something I noticed. Everything's a size eight. Stella's a size eight. Um, they sent this in a size seven. Now, I'm assuming that my stylist knows what she's doing and knows that these run big and sent me smaller accordingly. And that will be a good test to how this good, how good this stylist is. Because to me, that's what a stylist should do. She shouldn't be aware of fits um, and what you wear and adjust accordingly. So if these fit, that's cherry on top for my stylist. If I bought the whole box, you get a 10% discount if you buy the whole thing. So if I bought the whole box, it would cost me $105.80 and there's eight items so what do you guys think i've been real impressed with stella's boxes sam my son which i posted below that was a disaster it was horrible um watch that unboxing if you're curious because they sent him literally five things that i specifically told them he will not wear they sent them so i was very unhappy about that and i told them about it and the owner contacted me and she apologized and said, Miss Profile, you're right. We're gonna redo it. We're gonna waive that $8 and we'll get it out ASAP and I'll personally do it myself, she said. So I was real impressed with that response. So when they send me his box, I'll update that video or post another video with what their selections are for him again. So tell me what you guys think and please give me a thumbs up if you like the video and subscribe if you like to watch unboxings and I'll see y'all at the next one. The next one is a fashion box for me. Bye.